Welcome to an in-depth look at the Toyota Land Cruiser's brake system, a critical component for safety and performance. When the driver presses the brake pedal, mechanical force is applied through the pedal arm. The pedal ratio increases the force and transfers it to the brake booster and master cylinder. The Toyota Land Cruiser uses a vacuum brake booster in older models or a hydraulic booster in many modern models, often powered by the steering pump. The booster multiplies pedal force, making braking easier. When you press the pedal, a control valve opens inside the booster, creating a pressure difference that amplifies the force applied to the master cylinder. The master cylinder converts mechanical force into hydraulic pressure. It uses one or two pistons that move inside a fluid-filled chamber. As the piston moves forward, brake fluid is pressurized and sent through the brake lines to the ABS module and ultimately the wheels. The Land Cruiser's ABS module monitors wheel speed sensors to prevent wheel lockup. It modulates hydraulic pressure using solenoid valves to maintain traction. This module also communicates with the Electronic Stability Control System to adjust braking at individual wheels for stability and handling. After leaving the ABS unit, brake fluid travels through high-pressure brake lines toward the front and rear wheels. Brake lines carry pressurized fluid the length of the vehicle. Flexible brake hoses connect the solid lines to each wheel, allowing suspension movement. The system incorporates electronic proportioning inside the ABS module to balance brake force between front and rear wheels under different loads. Understanding these components is key to maintaining your Land Cruiser's braking performance and ensuring safety on the road. 